Well, there's a dignity in royalty, a majesty, which precludes the likelihood of assassination. Uh, now, if you were to point a pistol at a king or a queen, your hands would shake as though pulled in. Oh, I wouldn't point no pistol at nobody, sir. Well, that's a wise policy, a wise policy. But if you did, I can assure you, if you did, that the sight of royalty would cause you to dismiss all thoughts of bloodshed, right. and you would stand, uh, how shall I put it, uh, in awe. Now, a president. Well, I mean, why not shoot the president? <laughs> Keep the chain. Thank you. Uh, this is Strawberry Alice person. Um, tell me again. Uh, down the street and across, Greeley's Beer Garden and Billiard Parlor. Just ask for Alice, say you want a game of billiards. Billiards? Mm -hmm. Even though I don't really wish to play? Oh, no matter. They burned the table in 78 for firewood. Quite right. Quite right. Well, Miss Bershaw, I think a cup of tea would... So, Bob? Boys, this here's English Bob. Been a long time, Bob. Did you run out of Chinaman? Bill, Bill. Well, I thought you was, um, uh, but I thought that you were dead. I see you shaved your chin whiskers off. I was tasting the soup two hours after Ed. <laughs> well, actually, what I heard was that you fell off your horse, drunk, of course, and that you broke your bloody neck. I heard that one myself, Bob. Well, I even thought I was dead. Well, I found out it was just that I was in Nebraska. Who's your friend? W.W. W. Beauchamp. Beauchamp. This is little Bill Daggett. And friends, of course. Daggett. From New From Newton. Hayes. From Eveline. In person. <sighs> you work for the railroads too, Mr. Beauchamp? No. I write. I write. Letters? Books, Bill. Books. <laughs> Actually, uh, uh, he's my biographer. <laughs> uh, I wouldn't do that if I were you, Mr. Beauchamp. It's only a book. A book, huh? you boys can read. So I guess that means that uh, you saw the signs outside of town there saying, surrender your firearms. But like you told young Andy here, you're not armed, are you, Bob? Well, not really, Bill. I've got a peacemaker, but that wouldn't worry you, would it? I mean, if you don't see it, almost particularly if you don't hear it. I'm afraid so, Bob. I don't like firearms, sir. kind of books Mr. Beauchamp is packing here. Make sure you don't get wet. No shit, little Bill. All he's got here is writing stuff in, in this here book. The Duck of Death. The uh, Duke. Well, good afternoon, gentlemen. I'll have that 32, Bob. Now, little Bill, <clears throat> you will leave me at the mercy of my enemies.
Can I be his bomb? You've been talking about the Queen again? On Independence Day? <laughs> Think I'm kicking you, Bob? It ain't so. What I'm doing is this part. You hear? I'm talking to all those villains down there in Kansas. And I'm talking to all those villains in Missouri. And all those villains down there in Cheyenne. Business. 